Wednesday's showdown between North Carolina and Duke didn't feature as much hype as we've seen in past meetings between the longtime rivals, mainly because Duke is ranked just 20th in the country and was missing some key players due to injuries. But the Blue Devils shook off an eight-point deficit late in the second half. They stunned fifth-ranked North Carolina in Chapel Hill, 74-73. We hung in there. You know, we, we just hung in there. And um, we, we started going kind of exclusively to Brandon and Grayson and some ISOs. And, and then Luke's three was huge, was just huge. And this time, uh, Grayson hit the two free throws. So, uh, you know, that was pretty good. And, you know, we made some winning plays. But uh, we beat a re- I mean, they're really good. And, you know, we're fortunate to win. And, you know, we... But we were fortunate to win because we hung in there. The last play, we get the ball, we get to miss on the end. And Coach Smith taught me, and I believe, and I'm not blaming it on Coach Smith by any means. It's my call. I think you should always attack before the defense gets set. It's all, I've always believed. It's what I was taught. It's the way I've always played. And uh, I told the kids I should have called a timeout. Uh, we didn't get as good a shot as I thought we would get, but that's just what I've always believed in. And even though I say it's my fault if we had it to do tomorrow night, I'll probably do the same thing because I think that's the best way to play. It's Duke's second straight win over a top 10 team after they surprised number seven Virginia over the weekend. For all the latest college basketball news, keep it right here with Cinesport.